Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to make an in-private browsing shortcut for Microsoft Edge. So normally when you open up Edge, you'll have your regular window here. And then if you want to go to a new in-private window, then you could browse privately that way. So if you use this a lot, you might want to have a shortcut for it so you don't have to do that extra step there. So a couple ways you could do it. You could do the right-click on the desktop, new shortcut. And then for the path, you could browse to the Edge executable. Or you could just copy this in here like this. I'll put this in the description. So it's pretty much the path to the executable in quotes and a space then dash in private. Paste that in there. And we could call this a edge in private. So now we have our edge in private icon there. So we double click it. We're right into private mode. And another thing you could do too if you always want to do this, you could... Uh, just copy this here, right click on your current edge uh, shortcut, properties, and then you could go to the end here, space, in private, and then click OK. Then you have to click continue, and now you got the same thing here. And if you don't like it, go back to the properties, take this off, and now it's back to normal. You could also copy this icon or shortcut and paste it and then you could go in and uh, edit this one and just put the uh, space dash in private at the end just like that and if you want to make them stand out you could change the icon by right clicking on it properties change icon and then you could pick one of these. Sometimes, depending where you're uh, looking, you'll have uh, better choices for icons. I have this one here that I downloaded. If you look for online for you know an edge black icon, make sure it's a .ico file. And then you could also look in the like the Windows System folder has some icons too. So now we have our black icon there, just like that. So once again, make a new shortcut with this path in here. Or you could copy and paste your current uh, edge shortcut, then just right click it, go to properties, and then the target box, space dash in private. Or you could even uh, edit your main one if you want to do in private mode all the time and so on. And then of course, you know, you could drag it into your taskbar and have a shortcut there as well. All right, so I'll put this in the description like I said, and then you could uh, give it a shot and see how it works for you. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.